All right, so welcome. What I want to do is show you how to convert degrees to radians, because a lot of what we're dealing with is always going back and forth between degrees, radians, radians, degrees. So you need to make sure you can understand how to go back um, between each another, right? So what we need to do is we need to take our degrees and we need to make it into radians. And when we're talking about going into radians, I'm usually going to have it in terms of pi, right? Because remember, halfway around a circle is pi. So when we're talking about radians, we're going to be using it in terms of pi. So I'm going to deal with some kind of fundamental problems. So to take 315 degrees to pi. Now, what I want to do is remember that these are an equivalent ratio. Pi is the same thing as 180 degrees. So if I was going to use these as a ratio, as far as their measurement of an angle, these are equal to each other. The same thing as 180 degrees is to pi. However, what I want to do is I want to get rid of the, the degree symbol. So if I multiply 315 degrees times pi over 180 degrees, then what happens, ladies and gentlemen, is you'll see that I'm dividing a degree by a degree, which is going to kind of make that get rid of, it's going to kind of what we say, especially in science, that they cancel out the notation or they cancel out the degrees. So when I have a degree divided by degree, I'm going to get rid of now my degree symbol, leaving me with a term that's just in pi. So really what I can rewrite this as 315 divided by 180 pi, as the degree symbol is what we say is canceled out. So now I need to see, can I reduce this? And I see, is there a same number that divides into 315 and also divides into 185? Well, thinking of the easy numbers that we divide into you know, with our angles, 30, 60, uh, 90, those aren't going to work with 315. But however, if I look at maybe another possible angle like 45, I notice that I can divide 45 into the top and bottom, and I can reduce this down to 7 fourths pi. So what that means is the angle in degrees of 315 degrees is equivalent to 7 fourths pi. So there you go. Hope you understand. If you have any questions, please make sure you comment subscribe below. Thanks.